Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Master and that's Zintech Guy. So in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to draw shapes in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. But before we do that, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And if you do eventually end up liking the video, please hit that thumbs up button. So without wasting time, let's get into it. Now, uh, first thing, let's create our timeline. Let me just use a, a color mat. Um, all right, which color do I want? Let me just make it white. Okay, let me just call it white BG. And uh, I'll drag it to the timeline, right? Now, to draw shapes, there are basically two ways we can do it. Uh, let me start with the first one. Let's just go under file and uh, look for uh, a new, just say file new legacy title all uh, right let me just give it a name let me call it shapes okay and click ok now this uh, dialog box opens up this is the legacy title for those who were using previous versions of adobe premiere pro they would uh, this will be very familiar to them but if you started on cc Maybe you might not know about it. So when we get here, um, if you look here in the top uh, left here, we can draw a rectangle. Let's just click on that. Come here and draw a rectangle. And uh, let me just see if I can just add this, sorry. Yeah, all right. Add this and uh, on fill. Let me see if I can change the color of the fill on this right side here. You can, that's where you can make changes. Right, so we have, um, I don't know what color that is. It is it orange, is it reddish? Rectangle, if you want to draw this, what's this shape here? A clipped corner rectangle too. We can just do the same, just click and drag. You can hold the shift um, button on your keyboard if you want it to be equal. Let's just put it there um there's another shape let's just draw this one let's hold shift again so that it's equal let's put it there you can see where i'm going with it so all the shapes that you're looking for they are here uh so now let's just close this dialog box and uh, as you can see it's not on the timeline what we've done is here it has created this uh, object with shapes so we just have to click it and drag it to the timeline and there are our shapes just like text the text object you can just resize this depending on the length that you want so that's the first method of drawing shapes the second method let us go under window look for essential graphics just make sure it's ticked it's already open here under essential graphics i want you to go where it says edit and uh, click on this new layer um, click on this new layer object here just click on it and uh, you see options popping up here there's text there's vertical text there's a rectangle yes so we want to let's say we want to draw a rectangle let me just move this playhead here let's say we want to draw a rectangle just click on rectangle as you can see the moment i just clicked it uh, on the timeline it added a graphic object here to the timeline so just like uh, what we're doing in the legacy we can just resize this you can make it a square you can uh, uh, make it a rectangle so that's the first shape uh, let's go try and add another one right uh, we can click and just hold it by the corner there and drag it to our liking there's another shape right there um the, the probably the only limit that i see here is that you don't get as many options as you get on the legacy title which is uh different shapes that you can work with all right so this is how basically you can add shapes to your adobe premiere pro cc timeline if you enjoyed the video once again please give it a thumbs up if you have any suggestions for videos that you'd like me to make leave them down in the comment section below otherwise see you in the next video